Hey guys, it's Wednesday, which means it's my day. Yay, Natalie! Hooray! So, since it is October, I am actually filming from a pumpkin patch. This is my uncle's pumpkin patch, actually. He has a six acre corn maze and I think 12 acres of pumpkins. Don't quote me on that because I'm not sure. I actually think it might be a little more than 12. I don't know. Anyway, so since it is Halloween month, we're talking about fears. And I wanted to talk about three of mine. My fingers look so weird. Anyway, uh, so my first fear is I am very claustrophobic. Now, this fear comes from when I was 15 and I broke my back. Uh, two of you knew that. I think Desi and Sophie know that I broke my back when I was 15. Jackie and Nikki don't really know because I don't really know them. But that's what these videos are for, right? So when I was 15, I was ice skating and I fell and I broke my back. And I broke two vertebrae in my lumbars. And um, they put me, I had to get a lot of MRIs. So from the MRI machines, I became very claustrophobic. And I don't like tight spaces, they kind of freak me out. Also, from that incident, I am afraid of ice. Not like ice, like you put in drinks, but patches of ice on the ground. Because I'm, I'm afraid of falling. I guess I'm, I'm more afraid of like eating it and like breaking something again. So one time I was, uh, my senior year, I was with a bunch of friends up in Big Bear and I slipped on a patch of ice and I didn't fall or anything, I just kind of, you know, slipped around, freaked out and started crying. So that's when I found out about that fear. And my third fear I realized today was uh, I'm afraid of losing my cat Aries. Uh, he got out last night, my mom left the door open, and he got out and this morning when I figured out that he was gone I started to freak out and cry and just hysterically sad. So, and the reason for this, I think the reason I'm more attached to my cat than I am my dog and my other cat was because Aries was the last, like my aunt's last project before she passed away. And he's like my last connection to her. So when he got out this morning, I freaked out because losing Aries would mean like, you know, my aunt's, I lost my aunt. Which I did, but I like to have that little connection to her still. I'm walking through a pumpkin patch right now, so there's a bunch of crunching crunch under my feet. So there's a bunch of pumpkins. Oh, I want to show you guys something. This is a jarhead pumpkin. Weird. That's the first year I've seen jarhead pumpkins. They have warty pumpkins, and they have uh, Cinderella pumpkins, and ghost pumpkins, and peanut pumpkins, and gourds, and... You know, a bunch of, I'll show you guys what a peanut pumpkin looks like. Are you guys ready? Nope, hang on. There it is. See how it has all the stuff on the side? They're called peanut pumpkins. And then there's the corn maze, which I'm not afraid of because I can handle that. I go through the corn maze every year. And I'll show you guys the exit so you guys can see into it. That's a corn maze. So I will see you guys next week. Uh, I'm looking forward to your videos. And, um, you know, happy Halloween, guys. Bye.